The thing that I probably wish I would have understood um, a little bit more about Sundance was um, like, uh, I don't know how to say it, like, I wish I would have been more relaxed and like just enjoyed it a little bit more. Um, Cause you know, it's like, oh, this is Sundance. This is like, this is it. This is gonna start my career. Like, I think it's easy to fall into that. And um, you hear about people who are like selling their films and they're getting calls and all this stuff. But like a short film isn't really sellable. Most, you know, like some people will claim they are, but for the most part, you know, like, you don't make money off a short film. That's not why you make a short film. You know, it's not a, it's not a wise course if you're trying to make money. I got a lot of calls beforehand because, you know, they would release the films and all of a sudden, you know, like somebody would call and say, hey, I saw that you, you know, like I, I represent this or I do this or I'm this production company. And everybody, everybody kind of wants to know the uh, like up and coming filmmakers. And so they just like blast everybody, right? Like anybody who's got a film at Sundance is getting these calls. And I was stressing and I was, you know, like people would get, like I wanted to get the film as much publicity as I could. And, you know, some films were getting more publicity than others. And I would like, was trying to figure out who, like why were they doing, like why were they getting more publicity than others? And, and it was kind of like, just like random things like, like I had a friend who was like in this, um, like I met him at Sundance and his, his film played after, right after mine in the same program. And he was like on the cover of the Sundance magazine. He's like, here's like some of the, you know, Sundance short film. I'm like, how did you get your picture? Like, why did they choose you? And he's like, uh, like one of the programmers was like, hey, can you drive some people down to the Sundance resort? You know, I'll make it up to you. Most of it was like, you know, and I think that like, I should have been more, like in retrospect, I was like, I probably could have enjoyed it. I mean, I enjoyed it a lot and it was really great. And it was very exciting, but like, I was really stressed like the whole time. And I think that um, you could easily, I could have easily just like, just been like, it's okay. Like things will happen and people will call me later. And like people called me up to like, um, probably like six months after the festival. Like people were still calling going like, you know, hey, can we have a meeting and all this stuff. And like it all happened. Everything that I wanted to have happen is just, I thought it was gonna happen at the festival. And it just kind of spread out over like eight to 10 months of, you know, like, so that was probably the thing I would have, you know, if I could say that to myself now, I'd be like just, just relax and enjoy it, you know, don't worry about it.